the season is upon us. You always wanna give people gifts that they didn't know that they needed and it's aesthetic. They're going to appreciate that you are being picky and aesthetic about their items that they're just never gonna buy or they're just gonna get like a regular version of it. Trust me, people always love an unexpected aesthetic gift. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited. I just wanna talk about some gift guides or just Christmas gifts that I think are thoughtful, like medium price range and really aesthetic. While you're shopping, look through this list. I got you, like I have plenty of options for him, for her, and I have stocking stuffers, so I think you're gonna find at least some, like one thing on this list that you're like, I didn't think of, and I wanna give to somebody. Of course, everything's gonna be linked down below, so just check them out below. So some of these items I actually have. Some of them I have always wanted. They've been on my wish list, and I've kinda like vetted them by doing a little bit of research, and then some of them I don't, like I've never had, and I don't know too much about, but I thought would be super cute to gift someone else, or I've seen someone else gift it. I think you'll find at least one thing you like, if not for someone else, for yourself. So we're gonna start off with stocking stuffers. I'm gonna start off with these candles. These diptyque, I don't even know how to say this right, diptyque or diptyque, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how to say it, but these candles, I kid you not, are the best like the best Christmas candles, they're so potent. So I have, I actually do have all three of these candles that I've linked here. Um, I got the little Christmas set, so there's just like a mini version of each of them. And when I tell you these little baby things, they can really like brighten a room. I'm not kidding, like I can, I put it in my bedroom upstairs and I can smell it downstairs. Like it is strong, but like in a good way. It's not intoxicating where you can't breathe, but every scent is so good. So the blue one is like, I cannot describe these candles to save my life, but this one's more of like a cleaner, fresher scent, but it's all Christmas oriented. The red one probably has to be my favorite because it's like a sweeter smell, and then the green one feels more like Christmassy, like foresty, sweet kind of smell. But the I would say the red and the green are the sweeter, and they're probably my favorite. And not to mention, like, look just look how cute it is. Like, it's so cute. I've had this for about, I would say, a month, and this is how, like, it doesn't burn fast. I would also say, if you're thinking of getting a regular diptyque candle, um, I would say the rose one is my favorite scent. And I'm not just saying this because it's aesthetic and everyone's like buying it and it's like the new hot it girl, that girl candle. I typically, I've smelled a lot of theirs and I don't like all of their scents, but these are the ones that I recommend. Okay, another cute thing that no one's gonna think about is a water bottle, but it's flat that you can put in your purse and it's aesthetic. So I found this one on Amazon. I haven't got this myself and I really wanna get it. I saw a pink one and there's a gray one that I really like. Um, I'd probably go towards the gray one because it's minimal, it's neutral, that's my vibe. These are just adorable and like, it's not that you need it, but you know when you're like at the airport or you're traveling or you're just somewhere where you'd like, like the big clunky water bottles or the Stanley cups, like they just won't make a lot of sense. These ones, this is for those moments. The, these ones I actually do have, they're aesthetic scissors. It's kind of the little things, right? <laughs> like if you're gonna give this as a gift, it needs to be with other things, of course, but no one's gonna think about having aesthetic scissors. It only becomes like important when you're like putting your office together or you're having like your desk set up or you're like, your scissors are out. You want it to match your home these are the kind of scissors you want to get. They have the coming gray, the coming white, I think a few other colors, but I have the gray one. Every time I use it, I'm just like, see, this is what, this is what life feels like. This is not gonna make you feel good. They get the job done, but they're not the vibe. But these, these are the vibe. Like look how sleek and elegant they are. They're little and they're like really sharp. Okay, you've most likely seen these before, but these little hand sanitizers, Again, just another thing that makes you feel so elegant. I cannot rave about this one enough. This is the lavender scent and I've gotten the aloe, the green apple, the regular one. I think the regular is the aloe and I've gotten another scent. This one smells so freaking good. You spray it just like that. Oh my God. It like sanitizes your hand and it smells like you just put on like a really good fragrance lotion. This is another option. Nono Shinku or Shin, yeah. Nono Shink, no Shinko, no Shinku. Oh my God. 
I don't know why that's so hard for me to pronounce because I know the name of it. This is another brand. I think this is Japanese. Theirs comes in like these tiny little containers. But what's really cool about this one is that it's refillable. So you can, I got this set for myself so I can try all the different scents. And I think that's the perfect gift to give to someone. Like you can give them like these cute little things. Like no one's gonna go out of their way if they're not already into this to buy really cute hand sanitizer. Everyone makes fun of the TikTok girl is for being like obsessed with little random things like this. But when I saw you these socks, they have the little like, yeah, you can't really see it here, but it's yellow, like on the top of it, it's like a yellow stitching. And it's really cute. It's like neutral colors. I have a gray one, I have a white one, and I think I have a black one. I'm in love with these socks. I wear them at home. I wear them with my outfits. I wear them with my boots. Like this is such a good gift. Like I don't want to give it away because I want to do it for some of my friends, but guys, Bobble Bar has customizable blankets. They have a lot of customizable things. You go on, look on their site, you will find tons of gift ideas because they do a lot of custom things, but nothing screams like I know you the most and I love you the most than like a, a nice ass customized blanket. Like they remind me of the Hermes blankets, but it's like all about the person. So you can put their initial, I think you can put um, just like the first letter of their name. I haven't gotten this, I wanna gift it to people. I kinda wanted to get one for myself too. Okay, another one I've been loving are the Dagny Dober bags. I haven't got anything from them yet, but I really, really want to. So I've been obsessed with this like makeup traveling bag, toiletry bag. I just like that the material that they use is like, I feel like it's good and durable for like traveling or bathrooms or just like situations where the back could get wet or damaged easily. I like the materials that they use. They're a little bit more expensive, so people might not want to buy it for themselves, but it's gonna make, again, it's like when you get people these little random items that are like a, like luxury or a step up, it's gonna make them feel like that little spark of luxury when they're opening it. And then I thought this was like a really cute thing. Like if you don't wanna give people like items, you wanna give them activities, like give them a date night book. Give them like a we're not really strangers card set. Like give them activities to do because these are, are again things people are not gonna think of on their day to day. Okay, so now we're gonna move on to gifts for her. Honestly, these are just gifts for me. <laughs> so these are probably gonna be a little bit more pricey, but these are a curation of things that I really love, that I want to, that I've seen a lot of other people give as gifts or get as gifts. Number one, I'm, I'm gonna say this with a grain of salt because I've had one base bag and I absolutely love it, like the design. Like I got the faux leather vegan bag for traveling. It's so cute, like I still think it's so cute, but the handle broke. I pack a decent amount in my bag, so I don't know if that was my fault, but I would still suggest the bag because it's like, cute as hell so i would say any base bags um i like the new duffel that they have um it's like a puffy duffel it almost reminds me of the cow pack um duffel bag i would say definitely their luggages i've seen friends who have their luggages um they look really nice they have a lot of features that other luggages don't like it tells you if you're over 50 pounds or not not you but the bag <laughs> what i really like about the base bags is they have a handle and the handle has a cushion so when you're like rolling your bag throughout the airport you can hold on to the cushion and it's so much it feels so much better and like i have an away bag and it doesn't have that i don't know how good of quality it is but i would say even if it's temporary or for a year your friends will enjoy it i'm just gonna go speed around one thing I've been liking a lot is Aura Rings. I This is personally on my list. Um, I just think they're such a cute alternative than, than like an Apple Watch. I've never been an Apple Watch person. I just don't like the idea of it. It's just clunky. It doesn't match all my outfits. Like, and when you're wearing like an Apple Watch with a dress, doesn't really make sense. The Aura Rings look like rings that you would wear anyway. It looks like a Missouri ring, but it has like tracking abilities it tracks your sleep your health like all these other things like heart rate when you're exercising and like that's perfect because i want to get more into fitness again but i want to still look aesthetic but it is extremely pricey so make sure you get it for someone you really like <laughs> didn't want to put this in the stocking stuffers but it's like another cute thing that can go for like stocking stuffer or just a gift really cute carafes i have this carafe from west elm i love it i use it on my bedside it just makes me feel elegant when i'm going to sleep and instead of just having my water bottle i think it's the perfect gift i have one of these but i don't have the other part um i would say a standing desk i have a standing desk that i talked about my work from home favorites absolutely love it you can check out more of the details and how it looks and everything there but i love this desk 
I highly recommend it. It's aesthetic, it's white, it has a glass top, you can do dry erase on it. One thing I don't have that I really wanna get, it's like a treadmill that goes with it. Well, it doesn't necessarily go with it, but I've seen a lot of people pair it and I love this idea. You just have basically like a mini treadmill under your desk so that you can be walking while you're working. Perfect for people who work from home and they won't think to be like, oh, this is something that like could elevate my lifestyle or help me burn calories faster. I would just say cosmetic bags in general, or you could do like a legit like makeup artist like full-on cosmetic bag so i got this one from amazon that i really love i carry all my makeup in it every time i just learned this as of like two days ago but you can move the sections in the bag so that you can arrange the makeup bag however you like so you can fit basically anything you need to in there i got the smaller version but i think there's also a larger one because it's super sturdy like you can't rock anything in there and my makeup doesn't spill, it doesn't get all over the bag, like it keeps everything secure. I really want this, I want a record player. I don't have too much to say about it because <laughs> I don't have one, but I just feel like, again, it's like the vintage luxury vibe that is missing sometimes in your life. I would say diffusers. I really want this diffuser here. It is just so cute. It looks like a cloud. I wanna put it, in, and it's portable. You can take it with you to places. I do have the Vitruvi diffuser i love that but it is more stationary it has wires and all that so i like this one that's more like you can move it around with you also to go along with that humidifiers i also have a lot of aesthetic humidifiers you can take with you to different rooms and um, i think the humidifiers are really good for your face your skin sometimes also it could be health reason wine glasses these are the wine glasses I really I really want. I have other wine glasses that I love, but this is the style I still don't have. And I think this gives everyone that kind of like Olivia Pope, you know, vibe. Our place pans, they are worth the hype. I'm not kidding. I've, I have a Dutch oven from them and I also have a regular like our place pan or I forget what they call the main one. I love them. I use them like every week to cook. I've had them for several months now. It doesn't get like super crusty. Everything slips right off still to this day. I recently have been obsessed with Burberry perfumes. They have a collection called Her and I have smelled nothing bad from that collection. I have the Her collection. Um, I forget the name, but I'll put it here and I am obsessed with the smell. It's kind of hard to know what's the difference between each of them because I don't know if they have names. I think mine is the Toilette one i don't know i love london dream my sister has one my mom has one like we were all obsessed with it, with it and we actually got it in london but i can't explain everything but they're more of a sweeter floral but it lasts a long time so if your friends are content creators or they like creating content at all or they just want to film things or whatever this tripod is so cute and small and tiny and like gets the job done and it rotates. I, it took me a while, but I'm on the Ugg slippers bandwagon. I think these Ugg slippers are really cute. I want them and I will also put an Amazon dupe version. So it's a little bit cheaper cause hundred dollars for slippers is kind of hard to justify but i have seen them at the store and they do look really nice and they are pretty comfortable so i personally don't have a stanley cup but i've heard way too much hype about these cups my best friend has one she was raving about it i've seen every influencer and their mom get one i think this is a great one you can add to the list um everyone talks about how it fits in your car holder or like your car cup holder so that's really convenient and i I have to say I love my water bottle. I talked about it in my work from home favorites, but it does not fit in my car cup holder. So I might end up getting a Stanley cup. I had a TikTok about this Revlon hairbrush. Um, it is cheap, it is affordable, and it works. Like I have four type four hair um, and this works really well on my hair. It like blow dries your hair and straightens it at the same time. You can kind of twist it so it can do the swoopy thing. I've seen this LED lamp everywhere and I have no reason for it because I already have a lamp and I already have a phone charger, but this would be, I would love to get this as a gift. Like it's a combo where you can charge your phone. It's a lamp and it's like a soft light. Soft light is the way people. Okay, luxury pajamas. Like this is the perfect gift. Everybody goes to sleep, everyone sleeps, hopefully. There's a different feeling when you go to sleep wearing things that you feel super like confident or just like, that you love these pajamas amazing so i would say i would recommend skims i haven't tried a skims one but like i have tried i bought several things from skims a plus 
Target has perfectly affordable ones um, and they feel really soft and they're super comfortable. I've, I love all of them and I wear them like every week. If you really wanna go luxury, you can get Eberj, which is like the luxe of the luxe. It's really expensive, but I think they um, kind of specialize in these nice pajamas. Okay, so now I'm getting to the for him. And so I really wanna emphasize this section because my boyfriend does not just like any gift. So all my guy friends, they don't like just any gift. So I have really thought about this because I tend to see a lot of gift guides for guys and it's like, do the guys really want this or do the girls want the guys to have this? I get it, I would say both, but I think the gifts that I'm putting here are kind of things that I've seen the pickiest guys, like my pickiest guy friends and my boyfriend's really picky about gifts. This is what I've seen him actually appreciate and what they actually appreciate. Monos. Why I like this brand, especially for guys, is one, I think the design is more unisex, so it's not gonna be super girly and fun. Yeah. Away is another alternative. Guys always, they always look elegant with a nice suitcase. When you see a guy with a nice suitcase in the airport, you're like immediately thinking movie scene. Like, so Mona's suitcases or Mona's packing cubes, because guys don't think about packing cubes. They don't think about stuff like that. I've seen a lot of guys who are pretty organized or have things like really like segmented. Like my boyfriend's really organized and he likes to put things in certain particular orders. If they have a nice suit, they don't want it to get messy or they have nice pants or whatever. Um, packing cubes are great. And what's great about a packing cube for a guy is that everything's gonna fit because they don't pack anything. Massage guns. If your guy works out, or if, honestly, he doesn't even have to work out. Muscles just get tense regardless. So massage guns are really cute. I got my boyfriend the regular massage gun. I can't remember the brand. Um, he loves it. He also works out every day, so he might utilize it more. But I think even if they don't utilize it too much, it's gonna be like a fun thing. They're gonna be like, oh, this is kind of fun. I wanna try it. It's like a toy. So I personally want these. So this is for him and her, her, the Sony headphones. This is an alternative to the Apple headphones because I feel like Apple headphones, over the ear headphones, and they're like $600 or $500. If you don't want to get that, get the Sony ones. They're a lot cheaper. Um, steamer. My sister and I were talking about this and we just noticed how guys are really good at ironing things or like making sure clothes are in like good condition. I don't know if that's everybody or every guy, but we've noticed the guys that we've dated or talked to or whoever in the past, they're really good at like keeping clothes in really good condition. So a steamer and not just any steamer, a really nice steamer from Steamery. I don't have this. I am actually going to change it because I have one from Conair. And it just doesn't do the job sometimes. So I feel like a good steamer from Steamery keeps it aesthetic, keeps it nice, and they come in like neutral colors. So love this. I would say insulated flask or a Stanley cup, either one, Yeti, Stanley. I think they'll appreciate this if they're a coffee drinker, um, tea drinker. I got a little Yeti one for my boyfriend. He uses it every day. He absolutely loves it. And it comes in a cute like navy color. And they have a lot of other neutral colors that I think guys would really like. And if your guy needs a duffel bag, he goes to the gym, he's playing sports, this Herschel duffel bag, so cute. I love the good like black and like um, brown combo. I have a Herschel fanny pack. I use it like almost every day. And I think these are just like really aesthetic and neutral for guys. It makes them look nice, but it's not gonna be too much to where they're gonna be like, ah, I don't wanna use all like a duffel bag with all these tricks and whatever. Pour over. So if he's a coffee drinker, tea drinker, um, pour overs are great. So there's this one popular pour over kettle. It's I think it's called Stag. We personally have a dupe of that um, and it, on Amazon. It works the same, I think. Um, I haven't owned a Stag, but I think it kind of is the same vibe. I'll link the Amazon one and this one as well. So I think this is great and it's like, it looks nice in your house too, if you live with him. <laughs> and it's also something that they can utilize every day. I feel like guys just don't like these random things that have no utility. This would have no utility in my life, but I think from my research, they're obsessed with eating things that they can't handle, like hot sauce. So this hot sauce kit, I thought it's a cute like activity for guys to do, like a hot ones kit, or like something that they can just like mess around and play with like who can have the spiciest hot sauce. I think that's such a cute gift. Ninja air fryer. I. For the girls, I would recommend the Drew Barrymore um, air fryer in her kitchen line, but for the guys, they love Ninja. They love a Ninja air fryer, and honestly, Ninja just works really well. I've seen it in other people's houses. I've heard really good things about it. My parents have one. You can give it to your dad. You can give it to your brother. No one is gonna hate an air fryer. Uh, this one's like more music focused. Guitar holders. 
I think it's a great way or them to keep things out of the way so instruments all that stuff out of the way so you can put them on the wall you can mount the guitars or mount the instruments whatever you're using it makes the instrument look like a piece of decor so I think these are really nice and it's a nice thing to help somebody like design their space better and then last but not least are speakers so i'm gonna put these speakers here because i i've seen several people or several guys use them specifically gaming or if they're doing anything i'm not really like a big speaker person i just use whatever whatever is on my laptop the speakers that come from my laptop but guys tend to really like really quality speakers i think these speakers will kind of like suit everybody's needs whether you just like to listen to music whether you're gaming you need like a full-on work from home setup i think these will get the job done okay and that is all i have for my holiday gift guide i hope you can find something for a loved one or for a friend or whoever on the list and if you have other ideas drop them below i always like buying random things or just seeing things and saving it to a list for someone because uh, you never know when you're gonna need to buy them a gift it could be for their birthday it doesn't have to be for christmas so save these if you need them and i will see you in my next video thanks for watching Jack Frost nipping at your nose So I'm on